All right, what's going on, guys? Um, I just wanted to make a uh, a video on, you know, um, showing how to program one of these six O's. Actually, uh, this works for I mean anyone that has the same tuner. It's all the same thing basically. But I uh, I went ahead and threw a tune on it the other day, and it runs way different. I mean, it's it's seriously it's night and day. I mean. I have yet to get into the uh, the custom tunes, obviously, because I don't have head studs yet. Um, it's actually even a little risky running the can tunes on these things, uh, you know. But I don't I don't tear around on this truck. I'm usually just you know just daily driving it back and forth. No no crazy getting on it or anything. So I think that I'm for the most part safe. I mean, if anything crazy did happen, I guess I'm getting head studs right. So, but anyway, I wanted to go ahead and make a quick video so you're gonna plug it in it'll power up I'm gonna go ahead and turn the key on because it's gonna make you do it anyway okay it's just communicating it's gotta figure out what it is there we go these are the gauges. This is like the stock or what I like the the main setting. But uh just gonna hit stop data log to go to like the main menu. Yeah, here we go. Now you can look through um you know there's all sorts of things that you can do on here. It gives you your vehicle info, your device info. The device info actually this is I picked this program up pretty cheap because it's on its last unlock right now. It had one unlock remaining. And, um, as you can see, it's kind of got some scratches and stuff. It's not the best shape, but, you know, whatever. Because it says right there. Yeah, zero unlocks. And it's married because I have a tune on it right now. But, um, anyway, you can go here to program vehicle. Street use only, yada, 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 continue. Keys on. So now we wait. And I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to keep the same tune on it right now, but I turned the setting off. I'm going to turn it back on. So here, if you have custom tunes, they'll show up here, um, but I don't. So we're just going to go ahead and adjust the factory tune. Or, I mean, we're going to apply one of the SCT can tunes. I guess it's not really applying or altering the factory one, but... Um, since I've already got a tune on this, it's going to skip a step when it goes to... It won't save the factory tune. It will just write a new tune. When you do this for the first time, it will save your factory tune. Um, but, yeah, we're going to go ahead and hit next. Okay, so here we go. These are your tune types. You have street, performance, towing 65 horsepower, towing 50 horsepower, and then there's a transmission only tune. Um, I've got it on performance right now. And that's where I'm going to keep it. This is your EGR. If you have an EGR delete, this is where it'll take away that um, check engine code. So since I don't have an EGR, um, I have it off. Jake brake. Um, this is uh, they call it a Jake brake, even though it's kind of like a, a turbo brake, like it it's a, or an exhaust. It's not really an exhaust brake either. I mean, it's I don't know. It's not a jake brake is like a mechanical thing and this is just like the way that the turbo expels air or something like that. I'm not entirely sure to be honest. Um but you can change yeah if you've got uh, different gears in your uh diff, your uh tire revolutions. Now, I have 35s and 35s are 595 revolutions per mile. But I don't know, let's try something here. I want to try it. So we're going to set it at that. Um, I've got the speed limiter removed. I have not adjusted with the um, the rev limit. And my idle speed I've kept the same. So we're going to go ahead and hit approve. Now there's special options. This is where it will ask you about your tire size. So the lowest option, as you can see, is 600. And this is talking about revolutions per minute, which is kind of dumb because 35s, I feel like are a really common tire size, but maybe you know maybe up until I don't know what that what 600 maybe it's like a 37 
maybe up until then, it doesn't really matter. All this is for is your shift points, I think. It just tells the transmission when to shift. I don't think it has anything to do with your speedometer because I don't think that these SCTs can do that. So I'm going to go ahead and hit 600. Okay, and this is where you do the transmission. So there's different tunes for the transmission too. It's just kind of the same thing. There's like street, you know, performance. There's the toe tunes, whatnot. Um, so, you, I mean, you can do all sorts of stuff. I haven't messed with any of this stuff because um, when you when you put it in this street on its own, it automatically is going to shift way quicker and firmer um, or more firm. I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, it definitely does. I actually like the way that it shifts. I mean, you can change your wide open shifts from 1 to 2, 2 to 3, 3 to 5, you know, what all, all these you can do. Yeah, you can change all these shift points. And, you know, like I said, I haven't messed with any of that, so we're going to go ahead and skip through that. This is a, your overview of everything that you're doing. So it's on performance, EGR's off, Jake brakes on, your revolutions per minute, speed limiters removed. Yada, yada, yada. Continue. Now you just wait. This takes a little bit of time. I mean, some vehicles are a little quicker. Some, um, you know, take a little bit more time. But that's about it. Um, I'm going to, you know, keep the video going until it's done, done. But, I mean, that's for the most part it right there. Um, I'm going to probably continue this video with a little bit of driving um, just to show everybody what it's like um, you do not get a feel for it at all though through a video this riding in it is night and day difference compared to the stock tune from this performance tune even the street tune because I had it on the street tune first and that was that was crazy too I just even the way it shifted I mean it was awesome I loved it so I put it on the performance tune now and she uh, she rolls some coal now a little bit so it's kind of fun to play with, but like I said, um, I try not to tear it up too bad, so I haven't uh, haven't been beating on it too hard because I uh, would like to make my factory head bolts last as long as possible. But yeah, as you can see, this takes a little bit of time, but it does skip a step, so this right now will be actually a little bit faster than the first time for most people because um, this is skipping the... Uh, the saving of the stock file. Alright, turn key off. Turn key on. Now it's doing the ECU and then it'll do the TCU. And it's fairly quick, you know. Probably only takes 10 or 15 minutes to do all this. Whoa, look at that. Nice. I've never looked up at the dash before while I was doing this. That's kind of interesting. Almost done here. And there it is. I think that's it. Clears your check engine codes if there is any. 
which there shouldn't be, at least on my truck. And now it's done. I'm gonna go ahead and hit done, key off, and then it'll say that it lost communication, I think. Or maybe not, maybe you gotta be on the gauges. But anyway, let's see here. I'm gonna go ahead and unplug that. All right, guys. I will um, continue the video once I get the uh, the truck out somewhere, um, and we'll do a little bit of driving. Try and do just a little stop start pull here, just to show you guys what it does in this tune. So yeah, she puffs out a little bit of her coal now, and I don't know if you guys heard that, but. This thing's got some turbo flutter like crazy now. Like you let it build boost and then and then let off before it can actually use the boost, it it flutters really. <laughs> it's fun. Leaving black smoke back there. I don't know guys, I mean it's it's uh, it's definitely a world of difference, but I mean, I don't like beating on this thing too hard. But I'll do a little pull up here, just uh, get you know maybe like half half throttle, quarter throttle. But uh, I mean, it it's crazy what what that can tune does. So like, I myself can only imagine what it would be like um, with a custom tune. Don't I will for sure be getting one as soon as this truck gets studs. I'm. Like I said, I'm trying to make these studs last as long as I can, but um, as soon as we get up here a little bit, I'm going to do a little bit of a pull here. Alright, here we go. This will just be a little bit of throttle. That was only about 23 pounds of boost or so. I don't, I really don't like getting into it because like I said, I'm trying to, trying to make it last a while yet, but it's seriously, it's crazy. It's nuts, so. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I will definitely have more coming soon. I've got a few things that I'm gonna be doing to the truck soon here, uh, but you guys will just have to stay tuned and find out. But uh, if you enjoy the videos, please like and subscribe, <clears throat> and um, I'll catch you guys in the next one.